Hey, Jake Mace with Phoenix Longevity Arts. Walk this way. All right. We have a little arsenal of weapons. We have tiger hook swords. We have Bagua Sun Moon Forks. Okay. The camera can focus over there. We've got wind fire wheel, which is underneath the tiger hooks over there. And so a few of you are interested in some of the movements for the Bagua Sun Moon Fork. If you look at this right now, we've got moon, we've got a fork, and 4th of July is tomorrow, so this is your barbecue tool. I'm gonna to bring this to my barbecue and uh, my family loves to have me around, okay? Not. So this is uh, kind of like a Klingon looking kind of thing, but we've seen this. Um, a few traditional martial, uh, martial art masters from China. Um, not only did I see it in person when I was in China, but I've also found them on YouTube. And uh, they use this weapon, it's very traditional. We can thrust with it, we can chop with it or block or cut, we can pierce or stab with the moon, and we can rake or jab with the fork, okay? So a few of the movements I want you to practice with this Bagua moon fork is I want you to be in a good position, okay? Uh, I want you to bring the, the moon straight up, wham, underneath. And this is serving to fish hook somebody underneath their ST9 pressure points, the neck points. So coming right up underneath this way. Circle around and take the fork and flip it in, boom, and stab them right in the neck this way. Circle around, take the moon, bang, hit them with the moon part right in the temples. And then circle again, flip it over, pow, with this part in the temples again. So we have four moves. We have fish hook, we have fork, we have moon, we have upside down moon, that I want you to wheel it around and balance with your legs crossed facing the circle. Then I want you to work on stepping a circle, the diameter of your body, while your solar plexus is turned as far as you can toward the center of the circle, while your head stays level and does not bob up and down. Okay, so turning. Stepping, head one level, arms rounded, the moon fork's in the middle. Then, when you feel ready, I want you to take your right hand, your left hand, like two birds, die bombing each other, and full cut down. So both moons are slicing down. Circle the right one around, cut down, they make a T, and then continue to walk that circle this way. Turn the solar plexus as far as you can, keep the head one level, Keep the knees bent the entire time. And circle, 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 and end cross-stepped. And then I want you to watch this YouTube video again and do the whole thing reverse with the other hand on top on the other side. Okay, one more time, more fluid. So not only is this a badass wall decoration, it's a traditional weapon from Chinese Kung Fu.